Human trafficking is the fastest growing illegal business in the world. Human trafficking is a relatively new phenomena, even though slavery is as old as the ages. Well, first of all, we probably mix it up and say, it's not that they're a victim, they're a criminal. Let's talk about the issue of prostitution. A 15-year-old is prostituted. She's not a prostitute, but she is prostituted. So first of all, we get mixed up with who's a victim and who's a criminal. Secondly, we do the very best we can do. And that's why the concept of a living situation is so critical to the advancement of anti-trafficking efforts in Michigan. We trust that this kind of movement and people like Edie can bring us where domestic violence comes. The vision that I have for Sanctum House is a place of, of refuge, really, a, a sanctuary, exactly why we named it Sanctum House, a sanctuary for women to be able to heal and recover from the torments and the devastation of what their lives were. I know for myself, I was a heroin addict. I found myself in harm's way more times than I care to admit. And the reality is, now that I've delved into this industry and I know what, what it is, there wasn't a moment in time that I could not have woken up chained to a radiator someplace. Now that's real. And I'm somebody's mother, and I'm somebody's grandmother, and I'm somebody's child. It's powerful to me the fact that I was spared. I, I, I was spared and I am so grateful. And, and in that being spared, there are women that I can help and I know that. And there's a population out there that needs people, not just me. I can't do this by myself. I need people to support me and I need people to be the wind beneath my wings. That's really what I need. And that's what I'm asking for, for these women because they deserve a life just like I was lucky enough to get one. So this house is incredibly important, not only because it's a real strong first, but it also is that it could be achieved with an awful lot of help from an awful lot of people.